Hi, in this video I'm going to demonstrate how to put a text overlay in Sony Vegas. And the version of Sony Vegas I'm currently using is version 15. But it works the same in 13, 14, as well as 15, the one I'm showing the same. Now, what I would like to output here is kind of on top of this video I have here, I'd like to write there fuel pump disassembly. Now, you'll see I have a video go that's going to be playing here. And what that video is, is it's me... Uh, you know, opening a fuel pump for a car. Now, I want to put a text label here to describe what I'm doing. Now, how do we do that? Now, that's the point of the video. Okay, the first thing you'll need to do is I have the video here in the top line. Now, think about it. It's a text overlay. So, I would actually want it above the video that is currently playing. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to shift that video one line down. So, now I have an opening here on the top. And now on the top here, I'm going to now say insert text. There we go. Now the text has uh, um, box has opened here. And I, I said I want to call it fuel pump disassembly. Let's see if I've spelled that right. I think that's right. Okay, so I've got the fuel pump disassembly. And now I can show you what it looks like. I'm just going to shift this out of the way. And now you're not seeing it on the video for some reason. And I'll tell you what the problem there is. If you can have a look here, this thing needs to be extended for the entire time if I want it to be uh, playing all the time. So that's the first thing you need to do is that when it inserts a text box here, it does it for a very short time. You'll just have to expand it. So now I've got, it says there, pump disassembly. You can see it is too uh, large. And let me just um, uh, shift this down a bit. Right. Now, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to change the scale factor. Now, if I bring in the options here on the, uh, the video media generators, the option here for the titles and text, you can see there's a scale button or slider, let's rather say. Now, you can actually scale the image. Now, it's just trying to show you that at the same time. Look what's happening there. Can you, can you see what the scaling does? Okay, so that's what the scaling does. And then that's a that size is fine. Now, you want to change the color. No problem. So you just click on the text color and you can now adjust the color accordingly. And say, for example, you want it in on a, as a green shade. Let's put it somewhere there. And maybe you want it bold. And there we go. It's done. Now, there are a lot of features here, which I'll quickly go through and just show them. You've got uh, the background, line spacing, You've got an outline if you do want an outline, and you've got shadow. So these are all nice features which people can use. Now, I don't want to waste too much time on that. The next thing I want to show you is where to position this label. Now, maybe you don't want it sitting wham-bam in the middle of the screen. So what you're going to do now is you're going to press go to the crop function. And when you do go to the crop function, you can see that it brings up this screen. Now, if I scroll out i'm scrolling out with my mouse that's why it's doing what it's doing there see scrolling in scrolling out and i want that you, you see it's also giving you a scale option but i don't want to use it for a scaling function i want to use it for a placement or location option so now look what has happened there we go so now i've got fuel pump disassembly as an overlay and now the last thing is maybe you don't want it to be so um bold and when i say bold i mean maybe you want it to be a bit transparent well there is the opacity or transparency level here and what you can do is you can now adjust the transparency and there we go so that is a brief video on how to use the text overlay in the sony vegas software